Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Beast Like Bentley. As you can see, the environment has changed just a little bit. We're downstairs in the living room. It's raining really bad today, so you're probably gonna hear some thunder, a few birds singing, but right now all the dogs are sleeping, so I wanted to spend this time and talk to you guys about something very important that I know a lot of you are struggling with. So dogs in nature are just very curious and adventurous creatures. They love to sniff everything, they love to lick everything. Especially if you go on a walk, they have to smell everything. And oftentimes, when your dog gets into the trash or maybe the toilet bowl and they have a few sips, they're not gonna have anything wrong with them. They're not gonna have any stomach issues, they're not gonna get sick, I mean, unless they got into something really nasty. But typically, they're just fine. But sometimes when they get into something that they're not supposed to, could be a house cleaner, it could be when you're out walking your dog and another dog that was sick left you a nice surprise behind and your dog went up and sniffed it, possibly licked it, and sometimes ate it. Mm. This happens, okay? So then a few hours later, nothing is wrong and then boom, your dog hits you with some massive diarrhea and you're like freaking out, right? Because you don't know if your dog's dying, you don't know if you fed him something different, you start playing the blame game with your loved one, like what did you feed him? You gave him a piece of pizza, right? So you never know what happens, but dogs will get into certain things that you don't want them to get into and you have to pay the price because, well, they don't have these guys and they're not gonna clean up the mess for you, so you have to do the potty duty. So on today's episode, we're gonna be talking about these little guys right here, which are activated charcoal pills and can be used as a treatment for your dog if they have diarrhea. Nothing is worse than waking up to a stinky pile of doo-doo in the middle of the night and having to clean it up. Well, this little bad boy right here should fix the problem. Charcoal is a black substance that can come in a liquid, powder, or tablet form. It's made from heating natural carbon resources such as wood or coconut shells at a high heat. To make activated charcoal, you have to treat charcoal with heat and oxygen, sometimes bases and other acids. But what it does is it creates all these little pores and then it binds all the toxins to the surface area through a process called absorption. Now, it's different than absorption. It's not like taking a towel and soaking up a bunch of water and then it traps it in there. Absorption is a little different and what it does is it takes all the toxins and it binds itself to the surface area of the charcoal and then it can pass to your body in a safe way, getting rid of all the toxins and poisons. So activated charcoal pills are safe for both human and pet consumption. There's tons of research out there that have verified that charcoal pills do help with diarrhea and upset stomachs and you can find them on amazon walmart you can go to your local pharmacy and they'll have them there as well just make sure that it's activated charcoal so there's the difference like i discussed in the beginning so i did make a video a few months ago covering diarrhea because bentley was having a pretty big issue and there are a few home remedies. You can do chicken and rice. You can do some pumpkin, that helps as well. We love to give him some coconut water just to replace the electrolytes because when you have diarrhea, you get super dehydrated. And then we give him some yogurt as well just for good gut bacteria. But sometimes it doesn't work. And so that's when we go with the charcoal pills. Now in worst case scenario, we'll take him to the vet and they give this clay-like substance and he takes it twice a day after after his meals and that hardens it too but that can kind of run a little expensive and these things aren't bad like you can get a bottle for maybe like 20 bucks off of Amazon and it's pretty cheap so you can try these give these a shot and then if the problem still won't go away then obviously go to your vet so I hope this helps guys let us know if your dog is dealing with any stomach issues in the comment section down below thanks for stopping by and until then we'll see you again on another episode of Beast Like Bentley Peace.